Hey, how's it going everybody? It's Mark Brajak here. I'm currently in Norris Point in Newfoundland. And as you can see right behind me, there is quite a lot of water over here. Um, right on the other side there is a place called Woody Point. And in order to get there, I got to take a ferry, which I don't know where that is right now. Um, hey, there's some guys over there making a fire. That's pretty cool. I might go join them in a bit. Um, so I hitchhiked out here from Corner Brook. It took me seven rides, and everybody was so kind and so generous. Um, I mean, I just was not expecting to have seven rides. Uh, I was not expecting the generosity that was received from, I mean, well, I received it, but from the other people that were helping me out along the way. I'm just, I'm so blessed. I'm so thankful, and I'm so grateful. And um, a lot of people, oh, I guess I want to make this video because I want to talk about mountains. I mean, it's kind of appropriate. As you can see right over there across the lake, right there, these are all the tablelands. Um, and I guess there's more. I don't really, I didn't even know how to spell tablelands before I Googled it when I got here. And um, I want to talk about mountains because I posted a quote, I don't even remember what it said on my Facebook page about mountains that everybody like you see everyone's got their own like mountain to climb everyone's got their own kind of stuff on their own plate everybody's plate looks a little bit different and um, what I find like a lot of people do no one in particular <laughs> is that a lot of people worry a lot of people worry about other people about what's gonna happen what's gonna do this that or whatever and it's almost as if they're worrying about stuff that's not even on their own plate like they're worrying about stuff that's on somebody else's plate and uh, I don't think it's fair to the person who's worrying and I don't think it's fair to the person who's being worried about because the best that you can give somebody who wants their own freedom is is a blessing in order for them to have that freedom my mountain looks like this and your mountain might look like this you see my mountain looks a little bit different than yours you live you might live like this lifestyle where you get married and you buy kids and uh, or buy kids you get married and you have a house and you buy kids and that's what your life looks like right now and later on it might look a little bit different me as somebody who's backpacking my mountain looks a lot different than that mine might be a lot bigger or a lot smaller than yours or whatever it might be everyone's got their own mountain to climb and on top of that it's not even about what the mountain actually looks like it's more so about how we look at the mountain. And that's the quote that I had posted, uh, I posted on my wall the other day because I'm learning so much from this journey of self-discovery. It's absolutely incredible how much wisdom that I'm generating from, from this amazing, amazing trip. I just, I love, I love this. I love what I'm doing with my life. And I kind of wish I started sooner, but at the same time, I have no regrets about anything that's happened in the past. I'll do a quick spin right here for you guys to give you guys one last look right again I am on Norris Point Woody Point I'm pretty sure where it would that's what Woody Point is I would think and there's a ferry or a, a taxi that like a boat taxi or a taxi boat whatever it's called water taxi that goes across the river there uh, I guess it's a river a lake I don't know um, but that's not in service right now right now it is pretty much still winter so I'm stuck over here I might have to hitchhike around in order to get there, but that's a whole other story. Um, guys, thank you so much for checking in. I love you guys. Peace out. Have a great day. And until next time, live joyfully.